okie dokie, so uh, that's a start. Get our timer here and we'll start that. I've got it running at uh, 30 minutes. Okay. <clears throat> Space, so we go for the transponder code of uh, 1200. Keep the RPM at uh, 1200, just landing it a little bit so we don't foul the plugs. Alright, we're using 8 litres a minute at the moment. I'll just fire up the uh, Trimble GPS here. Go there nearest airport, so it's just got to search for those. Alright. Make the transmission. Looking for the wind top. It'll be 08. All traffic, Parafield uh, traffic, this is Tomahawk for Power Alpha Alpha on the Eastern Eight, but we'll be taxiing for run up a uh, Juliet uh, Parafield traffic. Parafield Airdrome CTAF. Okie dokie, so we'll turn off our anti collision lights, turn off these uh, interior lights. So we just got our nav lights on. Wait for the uh, 
We'll wait for the, the temperature to increase and we'll do our pre-takeoff checks to begin with. So the master switch is on. Checking ANUS, we check the uh, Q and H. Check the cal uh, calibration and the compass to the directorial gyro. We're on the fullest tank. Next is set was required. We won't put the fuel pump on. We won't uh, worry about carby heat until the, until the run up. Temperatures increasing, oil pressure is good. I checked the level earlier. Fuel pressure is good. We're charging. Static source is normal. <coughs> Everything's uh, the seats, seat belts, and shoulder harnesses are all secure. Fuel quantity is 112 litres. Wing flaps. Two stages, looking at both sides, and put them back. Trim is set at neutral for takeoff. Okay, and we got our vents closed. Okay. Just missed that, so I'll just go back again to that check. Flight controls full, free, correct movement. Cabin doors are closed and locked. Overhead latch is engaged. Radio is set. Okay, and our Cloud Ahoy flight uh, recorder is on here. This is what that is. Uh, the EFB is uh, set <coughs> in the uh, in the plan here. I like to go uh, position up, and uh, yeah, so that's uh, that's all good. And uh, what I do, oh, I might plug that in a little later. I might plug it in now. What the hell? Have a look. We'll grab this one here, and we'll uh, just <coughs> make sure that we uh, got enough charge on that. There we go. Alright. Nice. Okay, that's charging. Alright, got a little bit of temperature in the uh, engine now, so what we'll be doing is uh, bringing it up to 1800 RPM, we'll do our ground run-ups. <coughs> Set the parking brake. Set the RPM to 1800. Magnetos. Check. Left. So it doesn't drop between 175, but no on either magneto and not 50 RPM between the mags. Right mag. Back. Okay, should read five inches on the uh, vacuum gauge. Make sure the oil temperature, pressure, fuel pressure, amps is charging. Cycling the carburetor heat. to drop. No. Okay, no. Carburetor ice detection is on and we'll cycle the operation so that this red light comes on. Bit. Throttle check idle. Checking the mags at uh, low RPM and then setting the throttle to 1200 RPM. That's it, all done. Okie dokie. <sighs> Perfect.
vehicle uh, traffic, uh, Tomahawk power out, out of taxing from uh, run up a Juliet uh, for uh, 08 left uh, for a substation departure, uh, Parafield traffic. Parafield Airdrome CTAP. Alrighty. Okay, we got a Fox on the field to our left. We don't want him running into my propeller. Thank you very much. What is it? The fox has got something. Yeah, it'll burn or something. All right, we got another fox on the left there. Oh, so we'll just watch out. Wildlife, another fox on the right. Another one there. What are these things? Oh yeah, it's a fox, all right. There he is. There's the fox there on the wingtip. Having a bit of a munch. A lot of birds out there not real happy with him. Bunch of foxes out here. Anyway. Get to the whole point. So we clear the approaches. Landing lights. Probes on. Engine temperatures and pressures are all in the green. Flap set is required. Boom. ALT selected on the transponder. All stations power field uh, traffic, Tomahawk Power Alpha Alpha is now entering and rolling on runway 08 left for a substation departure, power field traffic. Mixtures rich, fuel pumps on. Um. Just check that runway. Uh. Make sure we don't get any foxes. Here we go. How much pressures are in the grain? Air speed's alive. Sixty knots. Seventy knots. It's gonna be a bit choppy, so we'll keep a little bit to Good 
traffic stop inside, MC Kilo, SQ Kilo, next one on a bay, Kilo, in that room. Then we got a Diamond Star. So we've uh, cleared our heading, now we're climbing to uh, two and a half thousand. Yeah, it's 210, uh, contact on Melbourne Center, 127 decimal zero five. 127 decimal zero five, yeah, it's 210. All stations, Parafield traffic, uh, Tomahawk to Power Alpha, Alpha has departed uh, and uh, overhead uh, the substation uh, steering um, one two zero degrees uh, um, for a south easterly departure. Powerful traffic. All righty. We're approaching two and a half thousand feet now. I'll just back off, it's uh, a little bit smoother now, so... Thank you. 
500, I figure. Hello, approach. Good morning, Charlie Bravo, Zilli heading 225, passing 1,200, climbing via Z4000. Charlie Bravo, Zilli, approach. Morning, identify, climbing via Z5, level 200. Z5, 200, Charlie Bravo, Zilli. Charlie Bravo, Zilli, uh, turn right, heading 330. Turn right, heading 330, Charlie Bravo, Zilli. Charlie Bravo Zulu, direct port Augusta, available advice. We'll take the direct port Augusta, Charlie Bravo Zulu. Charlie Bravo Zulu, resume on navigation 3, southwest Adelaide, take direct port Augusta. Direct port Augusta, thanks, Charlie Bravo Zulu. I've uh, just amended our little plan here to divert around a restricted area at Murray Bridge, uh, which is active at uh, uh, 290A, and uh, so it's 4,000 to 7,500, and surface to 4,000, so. Uh, 290B, A and B. So basically we've got to be about 7,500 if we want to transist that uh, that airspace. Seems nice and smooth here. So I'll just trim that off.
So we're going to switch tanks, set it for one hour, so I'll put a fuel pump on. Switch to the left tank. Fuel pump's off, fuel pressure's maintained. Just set this up, that was four minutes ago, so we'll make that one hour. And uh, we'll take an hour out of it. So we're starting. Countdown. So I'll mark that on my fuel log. So the right tank. Take 30. And the uh, time. Uh, 2016. So. Be all right if I maintain my heading, and it's not a not a hard one to do, really. It's just done right on that pillar. Unit thirty two zero four contact center on one two seven decimal zero five. Seven seven zero five. Unit thirty two zero four. Good night. Uh, six, nine, two, I think, 2, 000, 200 on and we're, we're travelling over the top of Murray Bridge now. Twin R and C tap is the Tomahawk Power Alpha. Alpha. It's 10 miles to uh, the northwest um, at 3,500. We'll be tracking uh, overhead the airfield um, bearing uh, 127 degrees to uh, the main field. Three wind R and C tap. We're on a nice little cruise, uh, uh, heading into wind, uh, doing a ground speed at only 94 knots, um, three and a half thousand feet, tracking 114 degrees, 113, and it is a uh, smooth as silk here on a Monday morning, at local time 7.02 a.m., UTC. 2032. So just a quick look at uh, where we're at. We've got about 44 minutes to go and uh, we've engaged a little bit more of a headwind and uh, only doing 89 over the ground at the moment. The frequency set in. We've got a Horsham already set in 118.8. Now there's no TAM out so uh, the no TAM reads. So let's have a quick look. That one there, so uh, runway 1735 is not available unless you have arranged prior or arranged uh, with the uh, the competition director. Um, I don't think it's going to be an issue. Uh, we'll just have a quick look. 
see how the wind's going, but uh, we'll be outside of uh, 0100 and 0300 hours anyway. Um, yeah, as we'll be arriving uh, in 40 minutes, it's 8.33 now, so just after 9 o'clock. Um, well, they'll be uh, 30 minutes ahead of us. So it'll be 9.30ish or something by the time we get there. All stations, you'll see Tampa, this is the Tomahawk for Power Alpha Alpha. It's at 3,510 miles to the uh, north uh, west of the field, um, on track direct torsion. You'll see Tampa. All stations, all from traffic, uh, this is uh, Tomahawk Papa Alpha Alpha, is 10 miles to the east at 3,500 inbound. We estimate the field to 1 4, about 6.5 minutes. Horsham, CTAF. Horsham, CTAF. So uh, we'll start our descent at this point. I'll just descend at about oh, a couple of hundred feet a minute. We've only really got uh, 1,500 feet to uh, to lose here. Or yeah. Want to be over the field at about 2,000. Uh, the field is uh, 445 feet in elevation. So that'll place us.
Okay, brakes are off, undercarriage is down, mixers rich, fuel pumps on, fuel selected at the fullest tank for landing, hatches and harnesses are all secure. Okie dokie and welcome to Horsham. Station's Horsham CTAF, uh, Power Alpha Alpha is now clear of all runways, Horsham. And uh, we'll just go straight up for the fuel. Okay, I'll do our shutdown procedures. Just check the mags, turn all the electrics off, and uh, shut it down. 